Hello everybody, uh, Dr. Rick Wallace coming at you. Uh, I'm out about the second time already this morning. Um, it's time I'm making a run for the grandson who said he hung, he's hungry. A uh, little rascal can speak and also learn sign language, so he tells you in all kind of ways when he's ready to eat. But uh, anyway, um, it's like 18 months old. You know, does a little sign language stuff, and you know he's talking. He's not like he's nonverbal. They just teach that to him at the school. Uh, but anyway, I'm coming to you because um, I, I need your help. Look, um, for those who are close to me, maybe a couple of you who watch this, you know that the last three or four months has been crazy for me. Um, but. You know, things are definitely getting better. I'm not a person that whines and complains and I get up and I put in my work and I do what I have to do. I was just reared like that. I was reared by my great grandparents. And that's what you do. You get up, you put the work in, you do what you have to do. And so I've done that. Uh, I need your help because I've had to make some really tough decisions about how I handle uh, people who come to me for help who cannot afford to work with me. Uh, I have to make sure I'm doing what I need to do right by my family and I've had to make some decisions but I've got literally seven people five women and then two of the women have teenage sons that literally need my help I have the expertise and the ability to help them but I cannot eat it all on my own I can't I need sponsors what I'm looking for specifically are sponsors people who are willing to sponsor an individual to work with me uh, some people can, you know, may own a business or may be in a financial position where you can sponsor a person completely. Uh, others may just be willing to give, you know, $10, $20, $50, $100, whatever, towards sponsoring an individual. But right now I have seven people who I simply want to work with but cannot work with because of financial reasons. And I give myself, I'll give myself I mean, plenty. Uh, you don't. Ha if you if you've been around long enough, you know what I'm saying. You know what I do. Uh, I go hard in the paint every day. I work seven days a week, and unfortunately, over since 2016, uh, which is a little over three years, October 2016, I've had three serious encounters, two close to death encounters, where I ended up in ICU because my body was just simply saying, okay, if you won't shut down, we'll shut you down. Uh, and I've got to be more attentive to that. So I've started really working on my health, really working out harder, uh, being more aware of what I eat, taking time to sit back and get away from it uh, because I was pushing myself way too hard. That's just how I go. I don't know how long I got on this earth and I want to give it everything I got. Uh, you hear me say a lot if you listen to my videos that I live my life on full because I don't I want to die on E. I don't want to die having things that I could have did that I didn't do. I don't want to die with with books not written, lectures not given, counseling sessions not given, lives not touched that I could have touched, that I could have made a difference in. I want to leave this place with a legacy that says I came, I saw, and I conquered. And that's how I plan on doing it. At the same time, I've got to be careful how I move about it because I have a lot of people depending on me. And I've got to be true to my wife, my children, my grandchildren first, and family, you know, extended family second. And then I move out into the community. I'm asking you guys to help me, back me up. And even now, with me sitting up saying I got these people on this waiting list, if you know somebody that needs help, send them. You know, because what we'll do is we'll find a way to source it out of whatever. Uh, I can do what I can do and what I can't do, I'm not going to do any longer. I had to make that choice. I had to make that choice because I've got way too many people depending on me. But look, we need sponsors, whatever you want to sponsor. If you, your company wants to sponsor multiple individuals, you can do it. If you're an individual and you are in a situation to do so and you want to sponsor somebody, uh, I would like to uh, work with each of these individuals for a minimum of a year. And I want to be able to give them the kind of attention they deserve. I don't want some, I'm just here to be here to tell you, I don't do that. I don't, I don't want to have somebody in front of me that I can't give all of me to when they're in front of me. And then look at their case 
on a unique and one-on-one -on -one basis and determine what they need and give it to them. Uh, I'm not here just to fill space and say I'm doing something. I'm not just here to say I, I talk to this many people in a year. I want to say I changed this many lives. And it takes work. It takes commitment. So I'm asking for your help. On that note, I'm about to get out of here. Have a great one.